516 now on your Thursday morning, and Central Texas is, of course, known as Flash Flood Alley, but we're also known to have extended droughts like the one that we're in right now. Now, measuring moisture locked up in the soil is important because it can mean the difference between your yard getting the rain that it needs and a full on flash flood. It can also help us as meteorologists produce more accurate forecasts for you. Today, NASA launches a new satellite which promises to help. And joining us this morning, we are lucky enough to have Dr. John Bolton from the NASA Goddard Space Flight Center in Maryland. Dr. Bolton, how are you this morning? I'm great, thank you. Great, well, we appreciate your time here. Now, we've all learned about the water cycle in school, but tell us how this satellite will give us an even better understanding of how that works. Well, the, uh, the observations from NASA's Soil Moisture Active Passive mission that are, is just about to launch is, is really a groundbreaking mission. It's NASA's first ever mission devoted to, to global soil moisture observations. And as you know, soil moisture is a, is a key variable in the, uh, the water cycle, energy cycle, and the carbon cycle of the Earth. So having a direct, continuous observation of soil moisture is really a game changer uh, in, the, in the Earth science and the study of climate. Very exciting stuff. Now, in central Texas, we are in the middle of a four or some even say seven year drought. How is a satellite like this going to help us? Well, the, the definition of agricultural drought is actually a, the, a deficit of soil moisture. And having a, a continuous observation of soil moisture uh, really allows us to monitor and, and forecast the, the implications of, of future drought. So this really allows us to assess the amount of water that's available to the plants. And if you're, if you're interested in, in being able to monitor and, and assess the, the, the agricultural yield and health, uh, having a direct observation of this, uh, the moisture really helps us, our understanding of the system as a whole. Obviously a very important tool, and I'm hearing that this instrument also has implications for uh, scientists like you to help get a better grip on the changing climate. How does that work, Dr. Bolton? Well, the key to understanding climate is having uh, continuous regular observations. And soil moisture is, is a very important variable for regulating the land surface temperature. Similar to how your precipitation regulates your body temperature, the amount of moisture in the top one or two inches of soil regulates the land surface temperature and also uh, as, uh, regulates the amount of humidity in the atmosphere. So this is the first uh, ever time that we've had uh, direct observations of, on a global two to three day time scale of, of map soil moisture. Very so exciting. It's a very, very exciting mission for NASA. It sure is. Getting a better understanding of droughts, climate change, got it all here. Now the SMAP satellite scheduled to launch at 820 this morning central time. And Dr. Bolton, we look forward to a successful journey. We appreciate your time. Thank you very much. Thank you. Now,